before we start the video, boys, I just want to let you know about a giveaway. We're giving away three Ultimate Movie History boxes to three lucky people. So all you have to do is like this video, comment your in-game name, subscribe to my channel. I hope you guys enjoy the video. The winners will be announced um, next video, but it will be in my Discord link down below and all that good stuff. I'll explain it in the next video. And anyway, boys, enjoy this video, and uh, yeah, I look forward to making more. What is going on, boys? It has been a while since we have logged into Alora. Welcome to a new series on the channel. This is going to be a hardcore Iron Man. I think it's been about four months since we've been and done a video on Alora. So we're going to jump on straight on in. We've got a lot of goals for this hardcore series, and I think it's going to be a ton of fun. All right, boys, we've made our account. Our name is One Life Hardcore because I have no creativity whatsoever, and I just could not think of a name. Let's make sure we choose the right game mode, though, because if we get the wrong one, I'm going to be so um, not very happy. But we've got a lot of goals, and plans for this hardcore series i know that i haven't uploaded in a very long time to allura uh but yes hardcore iron man yes please oh my god is that famous youtuber skins oh my god it is big fan so this video isn't going to be like full of progress so to say this is going to be more of like the introduction to the series and when do we have lobsters that's pretty cool um but yeah we're going to be talking about our plans for the series now we've got some main goals in mind the first goal is the twisted bow i've always wanted to get a twisted bow from raids and why not get in a hardcore that's pretty cool um i also want to get the max cape and on top of that probably the completionist monkey which you have to do like all achievements and everything and that's kind of the main goals i've got set in mind at the moment because it's a hardcore we've got one life will we make it i don't have a fucking idea but we'll see how many episodes we can get we don't really have a set plan for what we want to do right now um well my plan right now is thieving you get to the uh skimitar which i believe 80 and you get an addy skimmy so that's you know better than the iron 30 thieving coming in which means we can now move to the crafting stall well the ring yeah the crafting which gives us rings which you can sell and there's an update in the next 15 minutes pretty pog 40 thieving done now we can move to the general stall a very nice but what are these ruby rings 60 thieving coming in boys now one last stall until we can go into the skimitar so we need 20 more levels because i believe that is 80 i hope it's 80 yeah it's 80 okay great so 20 more levels and then we can get our first skimmy so boys we have activated 2fa on the account and we have voted so if we come to the vote manager and we put in our vote we should get a um vote a vote book we redeem that we get xp for an hour which is pretty pog and we get some crystal keys now you know me, I love to open the crystal chest, you know, in hopes of uh, 1KC Ranger boots. Are we going to do it? Probably not. Two glories, Pog. And there we go, boys. That took quite a while, but we got 80 thieving, which means we can now steal a skimmy, which is a nice addy skimmy. You know what I mean? That will last us until we get 60 attack, which means we can just get the dragon skim afterwards. But now we need to go smith. So we can get some iron and start training up. So the idea is we're going to buy ourselves a bronze pickaxe. And we're going to go start mining um, some ores. So we can get like the full iron set. I feel that's the current goal we've got now. And here we go boys. The iron plate body. We got ourselves 33 smithing. And we got ourselves the full iron set. And, you know we do look a bit better. A bit less of a noob. It is time to get our first slayer task. And hoping it's men or something. Rock crabs. Yes very nice. Something to go train and get slayer levels. 30 attack coming in boys. Which means we can use the adamant skimitar now. Which is a, it's a nice little upgrade. Considering we don't have to use the eye until 60. Because I really just didn't want to get a rune skin from fire giant. So yeah it's pretty nice. Just complete our first slayer task. We got 32 slayer out of that. And some decent starter stats as well. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. Another task coming in, which will be... Cave Crawlers? Okay. Another task coming in. And we got a hell load of fucking Herbloth. Uh, fucking... I don't even know the name of them right now. Weeds right now. Um, and, yeah, it was quite a nice quite a nice little task. Give me some good Hill Giants. Rock Crabs again. Okay. Give me Hill Giants. Uh medium oh no <laughs> that was a big mistake so we're gonna be taking the same route we did on our iron man series now i do plan to play it very safe on this hardcore because i want it to last a while now obviously it's going to take me a while to get stats in the safer like play but i just feel it's worth a grind 
just so we can make this hardcore series last a while honestly so what the plan is we're going to kill hill giants get a load of big bonus and then try to find a gilded altar we won't be using the wildly altar because that's just way too dangerous um and i don't really want to risk the account in the wilderness i don't really want to go into the wilderness to be honest with you i might have to later on in the account but it's just going to be super scary um but yeah that is the plan again i'm going to be kind of slimly following my iron man series with some of the progress that i do as i said at the start this won't be a super long video so um it's probably going to end soon and we'll be covering some of the big updates that's happened while i've been gone because we've been gone a while and the games some things in the game have completely changed and uh yeah we'll be covering that but what we're going to do is we are going to get a few inventories and uh see if we can get a gilded altar anywhere so we ran out of food but we found these public houses and apparently these two people have a gilded altar so if we go to tws um he should have a nice gilded altar oh here he is he's got a twisted bow what a nice guy we're gonna just yeet and i think is i think you have to, i think we have to light it honestly um what happens when I light it? What else do I need? Okay, so we can light both. And then we can use bones. And we should get more XP? Maybe? I don't know. We're just going to use up all the bones we got and see what level we get. Using up the final couple of bones now that we did get. And we, you know, we did unlock prayer, protect from magic. Um, we did get around 38 prayer, which is pretty good. I think next episode we will be just skipping ahead um you know, in clips just to, you know we'll be grinding out off of of recording and try to get around 50 60 using kill giants as a method so now it's time to, we need some food we're a hardcore iron man the main thing is we need food so it's time to do some afk fishing it's nice and easy you just click and you get fishing levels you can't go wrong with fishing a nice 40 fishing right there we all need to do is cook the rest of these and we'll be on to lobsters if you boys have been wondering what i've been doing while fishing i played a little bit of chess and uh yeah i i think a check's made him here i hope my man actually spent six minutes waiting instead of making one move so he could get checkmated <laughs> it's so sad and there we go boys we have 60 cooking which means we've got 60 fishing and 60 cooking i think that's going to be it for the progress uh side of this video obviously i said it was an introduction nothing major we got some base stats you know we did get a thieving you know some decent combats we're going to be working on slaying the next episode but to end off the episode we're going to be looking at all the updates that we've missed. We might, you know, we're going to make it an Iron Man episode, but also an update episode as well. So we're just going to take a look at the um, the forms, see what kind of updates have been going on since we've been gone. So from the last time I remember playing, I believe it was the four years, because my account did hit four years, so it was a very big thing. Um, since then, I've seen, what, Winter Todd? By the looks of it, yeah, they have added Winter Todd now. This is something on Alora that hasn't been around for a while. A lot of people wanted it. So I think that's really cool. Uh, the fact there is Winter Todd. I think that's something that's going to be fun for the hardcore as well. Um, but hopefully I don't die. That would be fucking awkward if I died at Winter Todd. Alora was the first server and the only server I actually saw do the leagues. Unfortunately, I just wasn't playing at the time. I just didn't see, you know, didn't play. And I thought it would be pretty cool. Um, obviously first place was PlayStation 5, which is insane by the way, the PlayStation 5. Um, but yeah, the leagues, I just thought that was, a, it was a really cool idea, but I just never, never played. And, uh, but yeah, that was a big thing. I think, obviously, Alora was the only server to actually have leagues. There was an update where they added presets to Last Man Standing, but also they completely reworked the, um, quest tab. So obviously, we need this to now as just the red, the statistics, but... Obviously, we'll show you more in-game. Um, but yeah, they reworked it to look... Honestly, it just looks really great. I really do like it. They did daily rewards. So every day you log in for 14 days, you get, you know, day 1 to 14. Then it'll change, um, which is pretty cool. I believe the word is that. That's a new pet. What? Pet Mimic? That's pretty insane, to be fair. With you. Wait, what the hell? Are... Damn, some, uh, some new pets. Uh, but yeah, as again, I'm just scrolling through the little updates. I'm trying, you know, the big updates that I've missed. Um, there's so many to go. Like, you don't understand me. If I went through every single update, there is so much information. 
in each update thread that it's just way too much to go over. I'm just kind of pointing out the bits that I think have changed a lot and look cool, uh, personally, that I like. But again, there's so many things that I might even know that has been updated. And yeah, you can rename tiles now if you right click mark it and then label it. Wow, that's pretty lit. You can name tiles. I like that. Um, there's quite a lot of things. What the hell? You can change the sky? I can't. That's mad. That's mad. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of um, update regarding like XP trackers, uh, rune light interfaces, and all that good stuff here. You can now rearrange the icons, you know, like your, your prayer. So you can change it to however you want if you are PK in that. Um, and they added like a tournament system, like you can actually like view people. It's it's pretty lit. That it's been it's it's really nice. And finally, boys, they've done a whole rework of the accuracy on everything, the PVM related wise. It's actually insane that they um have just took time into you know re um re changing everything. But yeah, as I said, there's a ton of updates that we we just barely looked at there's so much more information that i didn't really go through i just pointed out some things that caught my eye um uh, but yeah that is uh, about it but obviously we got some big end goals that we're not stopping till we get or we die one of the two i'm probably gonna die first um, yeah I'm, I'm i'm probably gonna die before i get to raids or max i mean i could just die next episode like, i mean i just Thanks for watching, boys.